Now, before we go any further, I would like our man here to come up the front, tell everybody his name, for those people who don't know him, and he's got a story he's going to tell you. Please. I thought this chap's going to ask him to turn the water into wine or something. <laughs> <laughs> this, this, uh, have it, that, that's my little miracle story for the morning, but we've got... We, it's Ian? Brendan. Brendan, sorry, Brendan. Um, Brendan's going to tell us a wee story about what happened last night when he went home. Yeah, so uh, I got home last night. Uh, I left a little bit early in the train. Uh, when I got home, I got a phone call. Um, and uh, this patient asked uh, whether I could see her. Um, and uh, I said, OK, I'll see you. So I got in last night. Um, and I got her in last night, yes, and <laughs> um, yeah, anyway, as it happens, uh, when, she, when she arrived, she, uh, I asked her what the, her main complaint was, what was her problem, and lo and behold, what was it? It was a shoulder and neck, yeah, <laughs> one-sided, I said, yeah, right, I think I can fix this. So I did the stuff that we were doing yesterday, um, you know, the examination, the recording, the, the the, the, the whole bit, um, and uh, she, had, uh, she had one side of her neck had pain on, on, uh, on palpation, um, and she had uh, you know, a limitation of movement. I did this, this, uh, yeah, this stuff, and it all kind of worked out. She was kind of out here on me on one side and out here on me on the other side, yeah? So we were talking about kind of quite, quite, a, quite restrictions are restricted. So I kind of did a little bit of Phil's ramble um, in terms of motorbikes and yeah, brakes and yeah, <laughs> crashing walls and if this happens, it happens and if it doesn't happen, it doesn't happen and so on and, and, uh, and, and treated her um, and I used a couple of your points um, on here um, and did the tendon stretch which worked to treat um, and, and really uh, got, got lovely propagation of chi on on uh, on heart seven because she was a little bit tense and she was working kind of hard and uh, putting gallbladder thirty four for that same reason. Um, so a lot of the stuff that you said yesterday, really, I just kind of I did. Um, and uh, you know, she she walked out a cured woman, literally. I mean, she 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 came in and she was in a lot of pain. She she travelled from Driffield to me in Scarborough. She'd come. She'd worked in Manchester that day, and uh, she kind of she, she had had a lot of pain. She kind of called me on a on a, an off chance, and I said, "Yeah, shoot in." And um, you know, so she was obviously unwell and had been for a while to to uh, you know to travel kind of thirty thirty five miles on Saturday evening to get a treatment. So yeah, a real real uh, treat. Thanks for sharing. Isn't it isn't it interesting how we get looked after? Remember I said yesterday we, we get looked after, we get given people and so on, and it'll happen, it'll happen for you. Yeah. And that's fantastic. Yeah. Thanks we'll heaps for sharing and really great. It's yeah, good, good that you got a result like that. Yeah, because it, it works. Really good. Yeah. Yeah. In fact, actually, she said, I said I had been on the course uh, during the day. She says, have you been learning this stuff, Brendan? I says, no. <laughs> <laughs> Not today. <laughs> I know this stuff. <laughs> Kind of cack handed, I'd say. <laughs> <laughs> okay, cheers. <laughs> 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 Top of the morning, too.